Today I'm going to share with you the five reasons why men end up ghosting a woman. After my previous video on ghosting, I received several messages on Instagram from different ladies who had been ghosted and that made me realize that actually the most difficult part when you're being ghosted is that you don't know why and so that's why I'm filming this video for you so you finally know why he ghosted you. I'll start with the most uncomfortable reason so we get it over with and I can already tell you that the last reason might be somewhat unexpected so stay till the end to find out what that is. Here we go, five reasons why men end up ghosting women. Reason number one, he met someone else and he decided not to tell you because it was probably uncomfortable and he just disappeared. If this is the case, I do not want you to beat yourself up about it or to start questioning your worthiness or you know, asking yourself if there's anything wrong with you, but because actually a guy who leaves your life is basically an opportunity for you to finally meet the right guy. Reason number two, he can't get what he wants easily, meaning maybe he's just after having fun, maybe he's just after having sex and he realizes that you have certain standards, certain morals, and you're not up for that kind of stuff. And since that was the only thing he was after, when he realizes he can't have it with you, he just pulls away and disappears. Reason number three, and maybe you've thought about this one already, he's going through some personal stuff. And even though you might have gotten close before he ghosted you, Maybe he just didn't feel close enough or comfortable enough to share that with you and he doesn't know how to open up to you um, and so he just disappears and starts ghosting you um, because he has other stuff to take care of in his life, maybe emotional issues and maybe stuff that he just has no idea how to share with anyone else, um, with you or maybe even his friends because men sometimes have a harder time sharing emotional stuff and being vulnerable and opening up. Reason number four, you might not have been giving him as much as he was giving you. What do I mean? Because this only applies to a certain case. So let me explain. If he was going all in and, you know, doing everything he could for quite some time for you, um, like if several weeks, maybe a few months, and you were trying to play hard to get or you still had some wounds from the past that kind of blocked you from going all in um, maybe some fears that he might leave or maybe you've just been disappointed so often in the past that it's hard for you to trust men even if you don't spell it out for him he's gonna feel that and after a while of putting in all the effort he might feel used and he might just give up hope and you know maybe get a little pissed off because this tends to happen to men more often than you think that they invest a lot and the woman just doesn't invest back into him when it's clear that he's serious about her um, and so he just kind of gives up and leaves reason number five and here comes the reason that i told you is probably the most unexpected one he realized that you're too good for him. What do I mean? Maybe he met you and he thought, oh, she's fun, let's get to know her better. And then you start getting closer and he realizes you're actually a woman with high standards, you're a high quality woman, you're serious, you're looking for a committed relationship and you're actually a really amazing woman. Basically, you are much better than what he expected but he's actually not ready for the kind of relationship that you're looking for and he's not ready to take care of a woman like you properly. So he's not up to the task. Maybe he doesn't have all his shit together in life um, yet. Um, maybe he thinks he needs to get other stuff in line in his life before actually starting a relationship with such a high quality woman like you. 
And so in the end, he just gets scared and he pulls away. So these were the five common reasons why men might end up ghosting women. And let me say this again, I didn't share this to condone the behavior of a guy who ghosts you because of course it would be much nicer and much more respectful to actually just tell you that he would prefer to, you know, take a distance. But the main purpose of this video is actually to help you understand what's going on and get answers without having to talk to him. Because as I said in my previous video, you should not run after him or chase him or try to get answers from him about why he ghosted you. So this video is to actually help you keep going forward and overcome this. So if you haven't watched my previous video, go have a look at that. And if this video was helpful to you, please let me know in the comments and share it with anyone who might enjoy this. I'm